Kim Kardashian flaunted her curves in a figure-hugging ensemble as she left her Calabasas office on Monday, after ex-husband Kanye West skipped their daughter Northwest's 11th birthday. The Skims founder, 43, who recently snubbed the heartless rapper on Father's Day, was seen standing next to a sleek, silver SUV as she prepared to head to her next destination. The TV personality celebrated North's birthday in NYC over the weekend, although West, 47, was notably absent while gallivanting around Italy with his wife, Bianca Sensori, 29. Kim showcased her toned frame in a clinging, strapless white mini-dress that contained a hem that stopped inches above her knees. She additionally slipped into a pair of open-toed, nude heels to allow the outfit to be the main focal point during the outing. Her long, platinum locks were parted in the middle, and effortlessly cascaded down straight past her shoulders. Dot the mother of four accessorized her look with a chunky bracelet on her left wrist, but opted to not add any other pieces of jewelry. Dot Kim's makeup was classically done, and comprised of a layer of mascara to her lashes as well as a light shadow around her eyes. Dot a warm blush and dewy highlighter was added to her cheekbones, while a nude colored glossy tint was worn on her lips for a finishing touch. Dot the reality star was spotted near the driver's side of a car and at one point, flashed a quick smile as she glanced over her left shoulder before stepping inside. Dot her latest outing comes shortly after the beauty returned from the Big Apple, where she celebrated her daughter North's 11th birthday along with a group of her close pals. Dot however, her father Kanye was not in attendance and was spotted just days earlier in Florence, Italy with wife Bianca Sensori, who sported a very sheer dress without underwear underneath. Over the weekend on Saturday, the group stopped by Paint Me Bear, an art studio located in the heart of Manhattan. North, who officially turned 11 on Saturday, held an excited smile on her face as she strolled closely behind her mother to head to their next destination after a visit to Paint Me Bear. North and her friends all sported pink eye, heart, NY pajama bottoms as well as matching, black shirts that had, North's 11th birthday party printed on the front. Kim was also joined by a few close pals of her own, including Lala Anthony and media personality Kai Sennett during the birthday celebration. During the festivities, they grabbed a quick bite at Joe's New York Pizza located in Greenwich Village, where Kim paused for fun selfie videos. According to Page Six, the Kardashian star whisked herself, North and a group of her friends to the Big Apple in her private jet last week on Friday. Upon arriving to the city, they made a stop at the popular eatery, Serendipity 3, located on the Upper East Side and indulged in scrumptious treats, such as ice cream sundaes and frozen hot chocolate. The group also sported different, matching pajamas that had I, heart, NW on the front, mimicking the iconic I, heart, NY shirts. Also on Saturday, Kim penned a sweet birthday tribute to her eldest daughter which was uploaded to her main Instagram page, along with an assortment of throwback images. The following day on Sunday, the Kardashian star snubbed her ex, Kanye West, on Father's Day as she opted to stay silent on social media over the holiday. The star was married to the rapper from 2014 until their divorce was finalized in November 2022. The former couple share daughters North, 11, and Chicago, 6, as well as son Saint, 8 and Som, 5. It appears the last time the reality star paid tribute to West, who also goes by Yee on Father's Day was back in 2021 amid their divorce. Earlier this month during an episode of Hulu's The Kardashians, Kim got candid about single motherhood and admitted that she doesn't have support. Dot while heading to jury duty, the TV personality called one of her close pals and said that she was a pushover and wished she could be more strict like her younger sister, Chloe. At one point, she emotionally added, I don't have that support and that really sucks and I know I really have to like get it together. Dot you know, He'll always be there for my kids and he'll ride out anything with them, but to say that it doesn't take an emotional toll sometimes, would be lying. Dot she later said, sometimes it gets just like a little intense. I want to be more strict like Chloe but I don't know why I have a hard time just saying no is no. I think I also just don't want to deal with the whining and the tears of not getting their way. Dot on Sunday, Kris Jenner also paid a Father's Day tribute on her main Instagram, and included a photo of Kanye in a collage of images. A few days earlier, Kanye West's wife, Bianca Sensori, left little to the imagination in another very risque outfit on Thursday of last week. The architect, 29, 
Baird et al. She opted to go without underwear underneath a sheer cloak-like dress while enjoying a dinner date with the rapper at Il Palagio restaurant in Florence, Italy. Meanwhile, in complete contrast, West wore a casual, covered-up outfit, sporting a white, long-sleeve top with pants and sneakers. At one point during their meal, Sansori got up and nearly flashed other diners as she walked to their table, strutting in embellished sandals with a tall, chunky heel. This comes shortly after the couple took an economy flight to Tokyo, where Sensori made a shocking display when she stepped out in a revealing thong leotard and showcased her backside during a shopping trip. Also during the dinner on Thursday in Florence, West appeared to be checking her out as she passed by in front of him. He reportedly was also seen shooting videos of her walking around in her not-so-modest outfit. Sensori is no stranger to over-the-top risque and jaw-dropping fashion as she has often been seen wearing increasingly revealing looks since she married the 24-time Grammy winner in December 2022. During the previous Italian trip in 2023, Sensori wore a slew of eccentric outfits during the couple's getaway. No strangers to scandal, West and Sensori continuously raised eyebrows over their choices in clothing, with Bianca's barely their looks sparking fury from locals. At the time her sheer and mesh outfits, which left her breasts clearly visible, were described by social media users as disrespectful in a country known for its conservative Catholic heritage. One of the infrequent, recent occasions was when she made the rare move of covering up in an opaque version of her sheer cloak dress at the airport in Japan. That particular instance was their first public outing since West's former assistant filed a bombshell sexual harassment lawsuit against him.